To find a and b so that f of x is differentiable and continuous at x equals 1, we need to assume that the limit as x approaches from the left is equal to the limit as x approaches from the right. And since differentiable, differentiability implies continuity, this means the derivative as it approaches from the left equals derivative of, as x approaches from the right. First set the two equations equal to each other. And then I plugged in 1 for x and simplified 2, 7 equals 2 plus a plus b and simplified that down to a plus b equals, two, equals 5. Then I found the derivatives of the two equations and set them equal to each other. And the derivatives are 6x plus 4 and 6x squared plus 1a plus 0b. So b is just 0 since it was a constant. And then I plugged in one, x, 1 for x, and I found 6 times 1 plus 4 equals 2. 6 times 1 squared plus 1a. And I simplified down that down to 10 equals 6 plus a, and subtracted 6 from both sides to get a equals 4. I can then plug a into the equation over here, and find b equals to 1. And that's what a and b will be for the f of x to be differentiable and continuous at x equals 1.